is yours. Thank you. With my high starch collar and my high top shoes on my hair, but high up on my head, I want to lose a jolly. I stopped the song. What? Okay. I love you, but I didn't love the song. I'll tell you why, because it's the sort of song I imagine if David ever released a single. <laughs> Honestly, that's what it would be. And I couldn't get that out of my head. I've just got your song list here. Can I hear the Greatest Showman song? Because then we can hear a different part of your voice. Yeah. Bless her. I'm trying to hold my breath. Let it stay this way. Can't let this moment end. Set off a dream in me Getting louder now Can you hear it echoing? Take my hand Will you share this with me? Cause darling, without you Spotlights, all the stars we steal from the night sky will never be enough. Oh, girl. Never be enough. Towers of gold are still too little. These hands could hold the world, but it'll never be enough. Never be Nika, that is a mountain of a song, and you conquered it. Thank you. I cannot get my head around the fact that you're 10 years old, mm. standing up there like a little professional. Thank you. It's quite an old-fashioned voice that you've got, which I love, and you've hit every single note. Well Thank done. Thank you. Ah. Uh. Sopanika. I've got to be honest with you. You absolutely nailed it. You're a gutsy little thing. You really, really are. I am going to kick this off with a mighty yes. Thank you. So proud of you, darling. It's a yes from me. Thank you. Absolutely yes from me. Thank you. You got four yeses. Yeah! You did it! Well done! She was 
was a sweet girl. That was amazing. That was fantastic. Every single person <laughs> on their feet. How did that feel? It was awesome. Hello, what is your name? My name is DeCorey Johnson. DeCorey, how old are you? I'm 11. And where are you from? I'm from Louisville, Kentucky. What is your talent? So I'm a singer. Oh, is that what you want to do when you grow up? All yes. of that? Yes, I want to be on Broadway and be in movies, and I want to be in Hamilton and Wicked. Oh, wow. Did you ever dream of coming to AGT? I watch AGT like almost every day. Simon, you are my favorite because you keep it real like my mama. Somebody <laughs> likes me. Thank you so much. So do you think you can win? I feel like that I can win it. Wow. Okay, so we're ready for you. Good luck tonight. Thank you. Lying beside you here in the dark, feeling your heart beat with mine. So now. ask you to sing up to the chorus uh, without the backing track. Yes. Yeah? All right. You got it. So now I come to you with a feel about that? To be here, I'm just so happy. Bravo! I thought that that was amazing, Decore. I think you definitely have a place on Broadway. When he took the track away, 
less is more. You're a better singer than even what you performed today. You are so Thank much you. better. Yes. I love what you did. Thank you. I'm very happy also that Simon took the music away because the music was just in the way. And I think all the, the path that you're gonna go, your wish, I think will come true. I have a good feeling Thank about you. you. I think you know the kind of singer you want to be, where you want to end up, which is really important. Yes. I think you have such a distinctive, great voice. Thank you. I think you're going to get better and better. It's so difficult to say what will happen in the future. What I can say, I promise you, is things are just going to be amazing for you. Thank you. Really. I'd love to be the first person to say yes. Thank you. Because you sound off the first time around. Yeah, he's tiny yeah. results, yeah. Tell me what you were feeling. I'm overwhelmed because I always wanted to be on this And so um, I'm glad I got it. Yes. My name is Brendan, Brendan Murray. How old are you? I'm 21. Are you with anybody today? Yeah, my dad backstage there, so he's watching. So, what's uh, your dad's name? Frank. Frank, what's up, Frank? <laughs> You've been to college, university, done any of all that boring stuff? Uh, no. Um, at the age of 16, I, um, I was looking, looking enough to uh, get a chance to pursue a career in music uh, with a uh, boy band. Yeah. So. Do you know what? <laughs> Hello. It's really strange because when I was 16, I also joined a little boy band called Say like That. So. <laughs> So you joined a boy band. What happened? Lead singer at <laughs> Yeah. Or were you the lead singer? Yeah, I was the lead singer, yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Orcs. What are you going to sing for us today? I'm going to sing uh, We Don't Have to Take Our Clothes Off, but it's the LA, LA Air version. Good luck. Thank you. I hope you like it. He's charming. He's very yeah. charming. Yeah. Took for granted that I want to skinny dip quick here. That's your game, but I'm not a piece of meat stimulating my brain. So come on, baby, won't you show some class? Why'd you have to move so fast? We don't have to take our clothes off. To have a good time Oh no We could dance and party All night And drink some cherry wine Okay I see an issue here and The issue is, I think Lyrically, that song didn't suit your voice. So I'm struggling at the moment as to who this guy's market is. You've got an impossibly perfect pop voice. I think you just made the wrong song choice today. Okay. Robbie, uh, I have an idea what okay. he should be singing. So, if you wouldn't mind, Brendan, I'm going to suggest backstage the song I think you should have sang. Thank you. I just think it's worth pushing you a little bit more, which may give you the moment I think you deserve. Okay. We'll You're see you nice soon. Line. We'll You're see nice you again, line. very soon. I think you should do the Stainless Woman's Work, Kate Bush. I think that's a great fact. Oh. I think they just wanted to hear a different song and yeah. like, wow, you got a great voice. The song I think you should sing is Kate Bush. 
Okay. Do you know the one it means? I don't know. Oh, really? Okay. okay. I think it's a better song for you. Okay. And you've yeah. got to hit that big note. Okay. I'm noticing that song choices are incredibly important. You see a lot of different people. Yeah. You've yeah. got an interesting voice. Thanks so use much. that. Cheers. Use that and bring it out. Because there can be so much energy taken out of a room if you get your choice wrong. Song yeah. choice about ten times. What are you going to be singing for? Okay. Okay. Swing it. You got the words. So, here we go. This could backfire badly on me. How's it going? Okay. I'm delighted to be here and over the past few hours I've just been trying to learn this song. So um, I hope you like it. Good luck. Sorry. Sorry. It's okay. Do you want some water? Think about the words. Make sure you hit the big note at the right time. Sorry, guys. This is unfair because you didn't know the song. So who's got the lyric sheet? I have the lyrics in my back pocket. Right, it doesn't matter. Sing for that, please. Congratulations, mate. You just had your moment. The paper drop at the end was quite something. Yeah, it was. We've had the mic drop, now we've now got the paper drop. Brendan, you've got a really, really special voice. Um, I'm not going to lie, I felt the nerves. I was nervous for you. I was really hoping that you delivered, and you absolutely have, lad. Well done. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Wow, Brennan, that was incredible. We were talking about song choice and having your moment, but I have to give credit to Simon. 
that was what you needed. And in that moment, just now, you were the biggest star in my eyes. You didn't know the words, but I have a feeling this song is going to change your life. I do. Thank you very much. So, am I going to kick this off? Am I going to kick this off? Where am I from? It's a yes for me! It's a yes for me! Cheers. Brendan, well done for coming out fighting. It's a yes from me. Brendan, I, I, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to remember this audition for a long time, and I'm delighted to give you your fourth yes. Well done. I've got to be honest with you, that was a bit boring. Oh. <laughs> you tried to win that. Right. And the audience agreed. Oh, no. They loved it. They were loving it. Do you have a second song? What was that? Do you have a second song? I do. Okay. Um. Cause you lift my heart up when the rest of me was down. And you, you shot me, and then you're not around. And it I'll try to knock them down And I'm all at your none, babe Now I know what I have found Cause now I've got you in my space I won't let go of your I got you shackled in my embrace I'm latching on Cause now I've got you in my space I won't let go of your I got you shackled in my embrace I'm watching on you This is what we Thank you very much. Um, do you have a third song? <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I could okay. if you want. <laughs> okay, Sophia. Usually when Simon asks, even though it's annoying, when he asks for a second song, he's right. This one was so much better. And Thank you. your voice is beautiful. <laughs> Thank you so much. You do have a beautiful voice, but you're also very easy on the eyes. <laughs> looking at all these gorgeous girls right here and they have all little hearts in their eyeballs. I think you're going to be able to come in off the street and perform in a building like this every night you want. 
this was a really good audition. You have a good voice. If you go forward, you probably got to go a little bit outside your comfort zone. And good for you. When we stopped, you quit. You just took a beat. And then you really did deliver so much better on the second song. So well done. Awesome. Thank you so much. Now the important part. How are you so low? Yes. One. Heidi. Yes. Two. Sophia. Three. And now you've got four yes. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Where did you come from? Oh, uh, right over there in the wings. You <laughs> snuck on, didn't you? How are you? I'm good. Good. You look excited. Yeah, I'm very excited. And what's your name? Ansley Burns. And where are you from, Ansley? Ansley, South Carolina. Oh. You've got a great accent, by the way. Thank Ansley. you. Okay, Ansley, are you like a comedian or a dancer? Well, I'm a singer. Are oh, you a singer? Yeah. What are you going to sing? Thank by Aretha Franklin. Oh. You're going to do Aretha Franklin? Uh-huh. At 12? Yeah. Okay. You sure? Uh-huh. Okay. All right. The stage is yours. Ansley, Ansley, sorry, babe. I don't think this backing track was working for you. I mean, it was a horrible, horrible backing track. Uh, so I don't think we can judge you properly on this. I really don't. We really like you, but that was terrible. If you're going to sing Aretha, you've got to have a great track. I'm just wondering whether we should just do a verse and a chorus, maybe a cappella. Um. Do you want some water? Uh, yeah. Hang on. Come here, come here. Ansley, I haven't had any of this. <laughs> this will help. Oh, my God! It's, it's yeah. like magic water, it's yours. Okay. Uh... Um... Will that just happen? Okay, let's do it. Go on, you could do this, Ansley. <laughs> you got this, girl. Gabrielle, what do you think? I think your level of professionalism at 12? I mean, I've worked with people three, four, five times your age who don't have the talent that you have in your little finger. You are really something special. Thank you. You've just proved the point. Personality to me is as important as technical ability. 
You know, it's the person I always remember. And you, my God, 12 years old is how we said it, coming on that stage. I know how scary it is. We're going to remember you. You have a great voice. Thank you. OK, now the most important part. Howie? Yes. Gabrielle? Oh, yes. Two yeses. Julianne? It's a yes from me. I've got to try and do the accent. Ansley, Ansley, Ansley. Ansley Burns, you got yourself four yeses. This is my song. Take my song. Hello. Hello. Very nice to meet you. What's your name, please? My name is Kieran Rhodes. I'm 20 years old and I am from Burn Hills, New York. Okay, Kieran, tell us about you. So. I was a baseball player my whole life, um, and I was planning to play baseball in college. And then when high school came around, freshman year, I had this sudden urge to learn how to play music. So I sat down at the piano, and I watched some YouTube videos, and I learned who Billy Joel was, and I saw what he was doing, and I was like, that's what I want to do for the rest of my life. And I taught myself how to play piano, I taught myself how to sing, and then I taught myself how to write songs. And then four years later, I got accepted into Berklee College of Music. Wow. And, wow. and that's where I go to school now. So what's the percentage of people who are self-taught at a school like that? Not many. Um, not many at all. It's, it's very actually intimidating being there. Because um, so say, many yeah. people there have been training their whole lives to go to that school, and it's everything to them. Um, but. You know, I just try and remember who I am and, you know, why I'm there and, Good. you know, what I do. <laughs> so I'm really curious why you decided to come on AGT. I think AGT is the best place for me to introduce myself to the world. Okay. Okay. Let me ask a question, sorry. So, do you write your own songs? I do write my own songs. Have you got one with you? Sure. It's called Disengage. And what's it about? Um, I wrote this song last semester in the fall. Um, I went through a lot of depression during that time. Oh. And I wrote this song trying to get through that. And I hope that it can resonate with you. Okay. Thank you, Kieran. Yeah. is a lesson and we're just improving someone's gotta help me someone's gotta help me someone's gotta help me help me disengage I 
we just witnessed something super special right now. Okay. Sophia. Spectacular. I loved it. I could hear you play and sing for hours. I was so happy. You're so talented. Thank you. You have youth, talent, you have it all. Thank you so much. Thank you. Howie. It was amazing. It was spectacular. I could feel the emotion. I could tell you're nervous, but you are a star, young man. <laughs> Thank you. Heidi. There is like a certain melancholy in your voice when you sing. It was beautiful. You know, you take it for granted when you see someone sing and play at the piano, but it's so hard to do, and you are so good at it. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you. Kieran, you're a very, very, very interesting person because you're very talented. And from what you told us, it sounds like people have been giving you a hard time, and I think uh, you know, when I was starting off in the music business, there were other kids, boys, who, they would talk me because I was in the mail room. It was like, okay, well, I didn't have a college degree, but I just made my way through it. But it still is in my head now. And I think what you're going through is not dissimilar. You know, it, it plays on your mind, you get depressed, but I didn't have the talent you've got because you're a great singer. I really liked your original song, and I really do hope this audition can change your life. Thank you. In so many ways. Okay, we've got to vote now. Uh, let me start with you, Howie. Well, it's a yes. <laughs> Sophia. Yes. Heidi. It's a yes from me. Kieran, you've got, I'm going to work out over 3,000 yeses. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot even describe what I'm feeling right now. I'm so, so grateful for this opportunity. And what got you into singing? My mom, when I was 18 years old, entered me in a karaoke contest. And uh, I keep doing it. It makes me happy. And what will you be singing for us today? Everything I Do by Brian Adams. All right. Why that song, Hunter? Uh, growing up, my mom was a big fan. And I'm going to try and make it my own. OK. Good song. Well, good luck, Hunter. Thank you. Look into your heart, you will find there's nothing there to hide. Okay, hang on. Uh-oh. Hunter, I think what you were doing was very generic. Forget about the karaoke competitions. I've heard that a million times. I think you have a good voice, so what's missing here? What's the missing part? Which artist do you look up to at the moment? I kind of honestly want to be like Taylor Swift. But she writes her own material. I do write. Really? Yes. Have you got your own song with you? Yeah. Okay, let's hear that, because this is a bit like, like you said, a karaoke competition. This is called Left Behind. Come on, take a ride with me. We'll put some gasoline in this truck. I'll fire it up. You let the windows down like there ain't nobody in this town but us. That's good enough for me. But that's only in my dreams. I'll watch the moon run. 
sun out of the sky to dream about her for just one more last night and for the rest of my life honey I wouldn't mind having you by my side oh the miles that I would drive to be right in front of what I left behind Right in front of what I left behind. That was much better. Much better. Hunter, um, this was this is like two different auditions for yeah, me. Yeah, I think the you might have just was, saved your booty with you that know, second song. You've won a karaoke competition and you sang a karaoke song, and now you're singing a song. Great melody, I like the lyric. So what's been inspiring you over the years to, to, to be here where you are today? Um, well, when I sing, that was probably 120 seconds that I made every person in this room forget about every negative thing going on in their life. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you, Hunter. I'm sitting here thinking, I don't believe a word of that. I'm kind of more interested in your real story, as most people are. There's something about it. I think you're a good songwriter. Um, what has been the moment that's been the low and the high point getting to where you've been today? Um, the low is I've been out on my own since I was 18, and I've had times in, over the years where I, I haven't had enough money to eat. And it just makes moments like this that much better. Okay. That was a good song, by the way. You've got some depth in you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Jodie. How old are you, Jodie? I was 16 last week. Oh, happy birthday. Sweet 16. Who have you brought with you? I brought my mum and my dad. I presume you're going to sing. I am. When was the first time you sang? Ever since I was little, and it's all I've ever wanted to do. And what are you singing today? I'm going to be singing Don't Rain On My Parade. Ooh! I love musicals. What would you like from Britain's Got Talent? I've always wanted to perform and to do what I love. It would just be amazing. OK, good luck. To live, just sit and potter. Life's candy and the sun's a ball of butter. Don't bring her on a clown to rain on my parade. The audience love it. I can't listen to that. No! Can I hear something a little less smiley and just a better song? What else have you got? Jodie, I love that song and I was really enjoying that. I think it's a shame Simon cut that short because terrible I think... Shame. It is a terrible shame, my dear. Thank you. There is much more to that song. Can't we finish? I, I honestly, I'm sorry, but I want to be able to hear her sing the whole thing. Can't we finish it? It's doing well to ask. You're going to sing your first song again. Yes, please. Thank you.
I really loved it. Um, you know, and it's great to have lots of different musical styles on the show. You came out with a lot of determination, really won us over, and that's what we're looking for. Someone with passion and someone who wants to win, and I really got that from you. Thank you. I really like you, Jodie. That song is full of personality, so really well done. I bloody loved it, Jodie. Wow, thank you. What I really admire is how you dealt so brilliantly with, with the critique and everything. You came back so much stronger. You <laughs> all over Simon's parade. <laughs> you need to have a strong backbone in musical theatre, and I think you're made of titanium, and I think you did brilliantly well. Thank you, that means a lot. <laughs> Simon. Uh, yeah. I may have acted a little bit prematurely there. I have to say, Jodie, I'm not crazy about those songs, and I did cut you off too short, and I apologise. But you got back into it. Actually, no, I'm glad I did that, actually, because you proved a point. Because you actually sang <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, that's and, right. That's true, because you came back with, with more excitement, more determination. And I kind of did it on purpose, now I'm thinking about yeah. it. <laughs> you always knew this was going to happen, didn't you? I always knew this was going to happen, and sometimes you've got to push people a little bit. So I'm actually taking credit for that performance. Congratulations. <laughs> uh, we have to take a vote, Jodie. David. I'm going to say yes. <laughs> Alicia. I'm going to say yes. Amanda. Obviously, it's a yes from me. And I am going to say... Yes. yes. <laughs> Your name is? Sean. OK. How old are you? I'm 31. And where are you from? Um, I'm originally from Nuneaton in Warwickshire. And do you work, Sean? Yes, I do. I'm an accounts manager. You got kids? Yeah, three. They're That's all true. here as well, somewhere, yeah. OK, so why have you left it till now to come on a show like this? Um, if I'm honest, I, I just get really scared. <laughs> just, it just, yeah, scares me a bit. And you're scared of what? Someone saying to you, you're not very good? Yeah. Yeah. OK. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. <laughs> I mean, if you're at all worried about someone saying, didn't like your singing. I, did, I didn't put myself here. Right, and I, who did? I, my, my daughter actually applied on my behalf. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, not much pressure then. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm looking forward to it. Good luck. Lost in so many different ways out in the darkness with no guy. Right. Okay, Sean. It was so jolly and happy and horrible that it it wasn't emotional. The with you, can you sing that? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Please. I'm trying. I've been down a shop. I think I missed the beginning, sorry. Hang on, hang on. Start again, start again, start again. It's OK. It's proper nervous now. I picked up your shirts this morning. I don't know why. I don't know why. Every place we ever walked 
And everywhere we talked, I miss you. Never leave my mind. So much of you is left behind. You. Keep thinking it's your recall. Everyone says it's all in my head. I can't accept it yet. I keep that you just give in. I know that I can live with this pain. These feelings of regret. Every place I wanna be, I wanna see. Thank you so much for your support. That was lovely. Uh, I, first of all, congratulations on what you just did. Why I really liked that second song, apart from the fact I love the song, is that you weren't prepared for it. And it was just the fact that you were just actually so much more relaxed. And I really felt that we were listening to who you really are. Uh, I thought it was great. Really, really, really good. It was really, really moving. The children will be very proud. Yeah, you're very lucky she signed the application form for you. So, now we have the real moment of truth. David. It was like watching a caterpillar turn into a butterfly. I'm going to say yes. It's a yes from me. It's a yes from me. You've got four yeses. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh. Well done, Ebony. Well done, Ebony. Well done, you. Well done. Well done. Oh, that was brilliant. Hello. So what are your names, please? So I'm Honey. And I am Sammy. I am Honey's mummy. Hang on. Wow. You're Honey's mummy? Yes. OK, so if you don't mind me asking, how old are you? I'm 14. And you're? 43. Okay. Today. No. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I'm always curious when mums and daughters work together, whose idea was it? Mine, I applied without telling her. Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> and what did you say? <laughs> well, I wouldn't repeat what I probably said, but after that, OK, fine, what are we singing? And, honey, why did you think it was important that you did this with your mum? Our past couple of years, our last two years, my mum got diagnosed with cancer. And um, it's been like, like, sorry. <laughs> Don't worry, you take your time. <laughs> sorry. It's been like a tough couple of years, and to be here with my mum is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Very great. And how are you doing now? Yeah, absolutely fine. It's, it's all fine. Oh, I'm thrilled to hear that. I, I'm just so grateful for everything. I'd never thought that when me and my mum were singing in like the car or something, that it would bring us to this stage. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> okay, I'm really looking forward to this. Good luck, guys. Thank you. Thank you. It's not simple to say that most days I don't recognize me. These shoes, this apron, his place, and his patrons have taken more than I gave them. And it's not what I asked for. Sometimes life just slips in. Right, okay, I just don't like the song, but your voices work really well together. Just Thing has to be one of those big moment songs. So, how would you feel about coming back maybe later on today? Okay, yep. thank you. Thank okay, you. great. Thank you. Thank you. We'll see you later. See you later. See you later. My God, that was quick. I thought we were going to see you so much later. We have just learnt this. I have got the lyrics on my hand. <laughs> You're so brilliantly brave to do this. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh. Not only is it a great song, obviously I'm a mummy. I can identify with the lyrics. I'm sure every mummy can. And she has really been my rock and oh. got me through stuff. So should we just do it? After everything you've gone through, you know, you deserve that moment. And I'm going to remember this audition for a long, long time. I can't imagine how difficult that's been for you both. But you've turned it into something 
incredibly special here today. It was faultless, ladies. Well done. Thank you. Thank you so much. I just love the connection. There's nothing more beautiful than mother-daughter relationship. Congratulations. Thank you. you did it. Every single lyric that you got right and sang just seemed so poignant to your story. It was just the most wonderful thing to witness. Thank you. Nice to meet you all. Hi, guys. Nice to meet you all. Hi. Look. Oh, OK. Oh. Hey. Hi, what's your name? So, we are Raksu. I like it. Can I just say, my, my heart is, like, going... Oh. <laughs> I mean, he's been talking about you all day. Like... Oh. You guys. You guys, I'm here. Everyone. <laughs> Hi, <Hi-nick. laughs> I'm here. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Nicole, sit down. Yeah. Okay, I'll sit down. <laughs> Shares is in the house. <laughs> so you've been a band for how many years? So we've been making music with each other since we were kids. Yeah. But it was probably about a year ago where we said, you know what, we've been doing this for so long, why don't yeah. we actually just formulate something? And... So you, you decided to become like a vocal group? Of sorts. Of sorts. <laughs> OK, and what's the song? <gasps> oh, so cute. Yeah. OK, well, good luck. On that sunny day, didn't know I'd be such a beautiful girl walking down the street. See no bright brown eyes with tears coming down. She deserves a crown. Where is it now, Mama? Listen, Senorita, I feel for you. You feel with things. Sorry, guys. That you I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, 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 that's not working for me. Can I hear a different song? What else have you got? Um, I'm Feeding You, which is something that we've written ourselves. Right, OK. Take it away, Jay. Cause I was like, I was like, I was like, hey, who's that girl from the streets just spot? Body like wall made my heart won't stop. Is what they say cause you look so hot. And I picked you girl cause of what you do. Dog, you are my grip tonight. And she should be all my girl, you can get let's go. I'm feeling you. So what we gonna do tonight? I'm feeling you. So what we gonna do? Then the next part is a true, true story, story about true how we met his girlfriend. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> Better at a shisha spot. Okay. Bold and locks in a lake good time. Okay. Pretty face, eyes and a smile to match. Didn't want to rush your clothes to pass. So I had to stop and play it cool. So I sat back and just get to the steady flow conversation for a couple minutes. Uh-huh. I smiled, then walk. she laughed. Okay. Then it's time to, I was just there, wrote back. Yeah, I travel like this, a time. She took more to give it life for the night. Didn't know what they had, but the time here was right. The clock to 12, but she left me in the night. Yeah. Now I'm sad here with just 
I'm 27 years old from Huntsville, Alabama. Look at that voice. Hey, Huntsville represent. Yes. Okay, Lamont, good luck. Uh, that's a very safe, what I would call, wedding song. What's the other song? Uh, what's going on, Marvin Gaye? Is it still safe, though? Your problem is that you don't take risks. Fair enough. Thank you, sir. Lamont, I wouldn't shrug to that. I wouldn't. So you want to come back this afternoon with another song? It's up to you. I'm down to do it right now, if, if we can. You think what's going on is what we want? I'm not sure if it's what you guys want, but I think it's beautiful. I think you should come back later, because right now we're not understanding each other. What, what do you guys want? He went all the time his head! Lamont, you are getting on my nerves right now. Don't be cocky. Okay? It's up to you. I don't know. I'll wait. I'll wait. Good choice. Take a risk, like you said, he needs to go find something else. I can't even do it, bro. I don't even know what key I'm out there. Dude, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I don't, don't want to be like this. A sour, sour. No, no, no. Really can if you, if I took a <laughs> you keep saying you can't, but you can't. Oh, Lamont's back. I thought Lamont was going to come back on a different day. Yeah. We're rooting for you. I learned this song like in the last 30 minutes, so forgive me if there's mistakes. I'm gonna give it a good go, though. No disclaimer, come on. Somebody say, got a new friend. Can she love hang on, me? Hang on, hang on, Lamont, 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 Lamont. One minute, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute. Right, shake yourself out here. Can I give you one suggestion, please? Yes, of course. Slow it down. Of course. Make this feel like you've just written the song. Down. Oh, yeah, that's better. Uh, hold on. This is another thing I had to see my guitar. I'm so sorry. You are torturing us here. It's got to be perfect, you know? I know, I know. Somebody said you got a new friend Can she love you better I can And I'm in the corner Watching you kiss her Oh, 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 oh. I'm right over here Why can't you see me? Home. 
threw everything at this young man, plus the kitchen sink. He went backstage, learned a song he's never heard before, played before, nothing, and just blew us all away. Perspective. We don't know each other well, Lamont, but I respect you for doing what you did. Uh, I think there is a wall in front of you, which is the fear of failure. And I think you've got to let yourself go a little bit. And there's nothing wrong by looking emotional or happy or sad. Yeah. And, OK, we're going to vote. How are you, Sonno? I'm giving you a yes. Gabrielle? I mean, you made a believer out of all of us. Thank uh, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I, I see it, I feel it in you. I want more. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Come on, you know what? Let's make the next one even better. So it's four yeses. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello. Hello. What's your name? My name is Yoli Mayer. Yoli. Okay. And what are you going to be doing here today? I'm going to be singing. Okay. And how long have you been doing that for? Um, since I was two years old. And how old are you? I'm 21. Really? Yes. Well, listen, good luck. Thank you. I put a spell on you Because you're mine This isn't working for me Because this is feeling very old-fashioned You know, and with the cocktail dress and everything else You're 21 years old Yes. Keep it young. You have a second song? Make it rain. Yoli, I want this to persuade us that you are a great recording artist. Okay? Yes. Thank you. She needs to be 21, and it's too... I, I get feel it. more comfortable now anyways. Thank you. Okay. Here we go.
abracciami, baciami, stringimi, respiro contro respiro. Can I just stop this for one second? Uh, what is your second song? You've got another song? No, I don't. You can't come out on a show like this and say you haven't got a second song. That's what live auditions are all about. You have a very good voice, but normally it's about connecting with the right song. I, I always want people with talent to do well, but just singing that song, that's not enough. There is a song, actually, would be amazing if you wish you'd sang it. What song was it? You can't just what, say what, that. What song? Tell me. Well, it's, uh, I don't think you would know it. It's just the song, it's the song I know. No, you won't know it, but it's a beautiful, beautiful song. So only Simon knows about the song. Can I ask a question? One second. Jason, uh, Simon, can I ask a question, please? He won't know, he won't know this song. All right, we're going to do something unusual as well. I think that you deserve another shot. We're going to tell you later on what this song is and ask you to come back and sing it later on. Okay. Yes. All right, well, thank you so much. Thank you, guys. So he's going to learn it now? No, how is he supposed to learn that? How is he supposed to learn it? I have got no idea where this is going to go. Passera. A double S. I've got your lyrics. Okay, so, great, luck. thanks. The song, the con song. I'm excited, but I'm freaking out. I don't have a lot of time, and I don't know what's gonna happen. I will try not oh, to mess it up. Oh my goodness! Wow, this is exciting. Okay, well let's do it. Passerà, passerà, sei un ragazzo e un chitarra, sono lì come te in città, sono la 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 che non va, che ci ammazza le illusioni e con età delle canzoni, passerà su di noi. Iremo tutti panta prima o poi, poi perché i chissà e le angosce di una ricca povertà, a banale di un amore che non hai, a cantare. Perché l'hai perduto dentro e ti ricordi solamente passerà. Passerà. You know, I think that just told us a lot about you as a person, you know, which is that it shows us your ambition, that you had the challenge. It's a very difficult song to learn and, and to sing. I think you did incredibly well with that. I really, really like you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I think that you are incredible. So I'm going to start it off with a yes. Howie? Yes. Well. Oh, yes, baby. Okay, you got four yeses, congratulations. I'm gonna guess you're a singer. Yes, I am. Why did you decide America's Got Talent could be your route to, I guess, stardom? 
I've seen so many other amazingly talented artists come on this show and have their dreams come true, so I hope it's the same case for me. Okay. How many years you've been singing for? Ever since I could talk. <laughs> since you could talk, okay. Yeah. <laughs> and what makes you different from all the thousands of other people trying to get noticed at the moment? Because I want to spread joy and love through my music and tell my story. Okay. Good luck. Thank you very much. Okay, Camille, do you write your own material? Yes, I do. Okay. I mean, that was okay. Um, you have a nice voice. Thank you. Yeah, my only issue is well, you need to do something more stand out. So I'm curious to hear what your songwriting's like. Absolutely. I'll sing an original. Okay. This one is called Still in Love. And what's it about? It's about suffering from a heartbreak, but you're still in love with that said person. Oh, was this recent? I've actually never really experienced it. Oh. <laughs> Nor have I. <laughs> okay. <Sweet. sighs> Thoughts of you won't leave my These memories I just seem to find All I want is to go back in time To when you were only mine What if I said I want you back I'm falling fast Back in love with you yeah. All these nights without Have loved me so new If you could love me for just one night Tell me that it's all Camille, the word beautiful comes to mind. Absolutely amazing. I mean, you just have that gift, and you are gorgeous on top of your gorgeous voice. I mean, you have the whole package. Thank you so much. I thought that your voice was much more than beautiful. I thought it was spectacular. I couldn't have liked it more. Thank you. Camille, I really like you. I think... You know, as with all artists, it's about finding the song that defines you. You know, and going forward, if you go forward, that is the key. Thank you. All right, we're going to vote. Heidi? I love you. I give you a big, fat yes! <laughs> of course, yes! Well, you got three yeses. <laughs> I'm going to present to you the roast of Simon Cowell. Oh.
<laughs> Please welcome to the stage the king of the nerds, Don McMillan. Oh, so I got into my comedy labs. I did a big data analysis, right? I looked at Simon's likes and dislikes, and I charted them, because I'm me. And so here we go. We'll start with his dislikes. Uh, number one, PowerPoint. If I'd known that, I would have done something completely different in my audition. 3% likability. That's really not likable. Uh, number two, uh, shaving. The man does not own a razor. Right? No, maybe you do shave, you're just so masculine, the minute you finish, boom, the hair pops back out. Uh, at 1%, Parmesan cheese. <laughs> Parmesan, Parmesan. Uh, clowns, if you know, he hates clowns. Yeah, I, I can't even stay on this slide. And finally, the biggest dislike, minus 6%, is uh, falling off a bike. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry. Too, too soon? Have you thought about training wheels? That's all I'm saying. That's all. <laughs> So Sophia! You, you did so much magic in two and a half minutes that I don't even know what I was seeing. You made me believe in magic. This is amazing. This was better than your audition. And I really want to know what Simon thinks. Simon, did he win you over? I think I helped you. No! I do. I really, really do. I the think magic that... Of Simon. No, by me saying no at the auditions, I think has pushed you to be a better magician. <laughs> and I'm very happy to say on live television, I am officially an idiot. Yeah! No. <laughs> Howie! You don't want to give a standing ovation to, let me finish, to Howard Stern. Because I think you made the best choice. He this did. is probably the best wild card. Uh, please, Nobody please, has done please, better. Hug it out. Hug it out. They're going to kiss on live TV. They were arguing. Oh! I think I see tongue. There was tongue involved. Magic is definitely in the air. Oh, my God. You did it. Hi, Howie. They kissed on live television. Where's my wife? <laughs> and it... Hi, my name is Vanessa, and I'm from South Pasadena. My question for Simon is, what animal do you think you look like the most? I think it's a lemur. And I remember seeing a nature program once, and I thought, that actually looks like me. Sophia. The chihuahua that you posted this morning on your Instagram story, is that yours? And do you have more? <laughs> I have two chihuahuas in my life. Oh, one oh. is my son, and the other one oh, was oh. supposed to be my dog, but she hates me and loves my husband, and she's a very bad dog. Oh, oh. And we have a question for Heidi. I would love to know what her most embarrassing moment is. I have four children, and I would say to them, everything I do is embarrassing. What's up, Darcy? Hey. I'm looking for a partner, you know? Maybe we can do something. You do ventriloquism? What? Oh, do I? Bam! That wasn't even me who said that. Is that a sock? No, it's not. <gasps> it's a sock. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, Z, You're moving your mouth. Yellow. Come on. You can do better. Why are you being me? You're still moving your mouth. <laughs> You don't even know what I'm talking about now. This is never going to work. Awkward. So if you had to be on a desert island for the rest of your life with either me or mummy, who would it be? Why? Why? <laughs> like father, like son. Are you trying to do my job? Are you? What do I do? That is my job. Just like your daddy. I think maybe you need a little better choreography. Yeah, I was disappointed, sorry. That was uh, 
beautiful. What I feel the same way. I lyric. always want more Parmesan. Thank I was you. right there. I know, I know. Why I are they so stingy on the Parmesan? Parmesan. It's disgusting. What? No. Uh, I don't know why I'm even having this conversation yeah. anyway, because I don't like Parmesan. I don't like your song. So I'm saying no. Howie, what do you think? I gotta say I didn't I didn't love it. Sophia! It's a no. I don't know what was happening. Wow. Oh my god. I want to say this from, from my heart here. Uh, what you have done for the show, and as a friend, as one of the most amazing people I've ever worked with, oh, wow. I wanted to pay you a tribute to show your significance, and most importantly, your importance for the 10 years you've been on the show. Over to you, Tony. Hey, it's out on Sunset Boulevard. OK, let's take what? a look. Here we go. Count it down with me, people. Where am I looking? Five, four, three, two, one. And that didn't sit well with a lot of people online. Right. Uh, right. How do you respond to that? Um, I'm not responding to them. You but, should apologize. But, you know what? The competition was brutal. The, and, and last night, we had the highest of highs and then some incredible, for me, personal disappointments. And we are here, and we are all paid, to be honest. I am brutally honest. That's why it was brutal. Good luck to everyone. But you sometimes are also grumpy. I'm not grumpy. Yeah, okay. <laughs> and also, I'm, I'm translating. Yeah. She said grumpy. Okay. Well, you they know what? Me. This is a good sign. Listen, Sophia, a lot of the judges, you guys disagreed on a lot of the acts last night. Why do you think that was? Um, well, we, girl, first of all, we have different tastes. And we, we all have the same taste. Some of them <laughs> don't know what, they, <laughs> what, they, what they're supposed to know. Uh, I know everything grumpy? we know. <laughs> How is grumpy sometimes, and Simon is sometimes loco, so it's, there's nothing. No, I admit it. I do admit it. <laughs> no. Hey, Heidi. Your hand binoculars are ridiculous. Stop it. You don't understand. They're not binoculars. Yes, they are. No. What it does, it takes the light outside from it makes the outside, sense. and it gets darker around, and then I can actually see better. I need to my focus glasses. into some parts yes. sometimes. Exactly. So it's not it so bright. Sense. Because when it's so bright, I can't see what they're doing, and I need to judge. So my family and I are watching AGT, and my dad says, "Is Beyonce always on this? It's Tyra Banks." <laughs> Or is it? Blue Ivy, Blue Ivy, sit down right now. Mama gotta host this show, Blue. AGT made Simon Cowell so soft. Oh, good, good. Oh, no. Yes, for me. I want Simon the Savage back. The one who crushed dreams and made people cry for fun. <laughs> off. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. That is Heidi having lunch. Do you feel it's Heidi chewing something? Heidi chewing chips. Sounds like a hamster is eating something. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the guy crushing the nuts with his butt cheeks. Mr. Cherry, I love him. It was hard. It really hurt. Can I introduce you to Mr. Grumpy? I have it. You wow. want to meet him? Yes. This is Mr. Grumpy. Oh my gosh, Mr. Grumpy. Hi, Mr. Grumpy. It's so nice to meet you. Oh, oh hi, Darcy. Hi, Sophia. I wow. haven't seen you in a long time. You look beautiful. You look young every day. So how, how long have you, how long have you been doing? 
Oh, I've done it for 11 years. 11 Can years. You dance? Wow, it's amazing. Mr. Grumpy would get along well with my friend Edna. Edna, Edna, where are you? Hi. Oh, oh hi, Edna. You are very old. What? You're very old. What? Old. Hello, darlings. Sophia, I don't just like Edna. I love Edna. Moving, I can do this too. He's moving his lips. There was, you know, we would deliberate a lot about whether we put you through to the final. I think Howie in particular didn't want you to be here. Ah, yes. And no. I said, no, you know what? No. no. I don't care why you say, Howie, no. they're going through to the finals. And you know what? I was right. And you know what I love about you? <laughs> it's different and it's yeah. difficult. Okay. And I like people who take that moment. And you took that moment. And we're going to remember yeah. you. For me, yeah. best act of the night. Only two are going through, remember. You've got to vote. Howie Canada represent. Yeah, he's a liar, eh? <laughs> no, I'm he's not. a real liar, eh? The only thing I'm mad at is that you worked on Canada's Got Talent. You would have won Canada's Got Talent. You guys are so fucking good. <laughs> we got another question from Zach, who is a big male B fan. What's your question, Zach? Hey, <laughs> It's like, his, it's like his first time online. <laughs> <laughs> Sit back, young man. He's excited. Thank you so much. Hi, Girl Power, Melanie. My question is, <laughs> what exactly does off the chain mean? It means that I'm hey, really so excited good. about the act, and I think it's, like, amazing. So I say it's off the chain, as in, like, wowza. <laughs> yeah, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> the definition of off the chain is wowzer. Yeah. You know what I mean? He understands. He gets it. I do. <laughs> Great job, Zach. <laughs> this word is magic. Did you just look? No, not at the. Are no. you guys talking? No. Freak. Magic. Yeah. Yes. 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 Magic is the correct. <laughs> Cheating. Who heard him tell me the word? That's that cheating. That means that you were cheating already. <laughs> They're him cheating him because they heard you cheated. <laughs> All right, nice. this is the I'm final sweating. clue. The we clue? are actually tied at the moment, <laughs> and we are going to start with Howie. The okay. password is... Ready? Million. Dollars. Million. Oh! He's right! Thank That's you very it. much. Everybody. That is the word. Simon and Howie have won! Yes.